In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to connect Logitech G Pro X Super Lite to PlayStation 5. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm gonna give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly set up and use your Logitech G Pro X Super Lite on a PlayStation 5 console. This mouse is not designed to be used with consoles, however, it will work natively on the PlayStation 5. You won't be able to access the software, G Hub, and customize a lot of options like the sensitive. Activity, DPI, and so on. However, you will be able to use it to play any game available on your console. So, first, I recommend using the wireless dongle. See if that works, and if it doesn't, then you will have to use a wired connection. For the wireless dongle, all that you have to do is make sure that it is properly connected into the dongle. So, plug the actual wireless adapter into the dongle, and then you will be able to connect the dongle to the PlayStation 5 using the provided USB A to USB C cable. Once this is done, place the mouse in close proximity of the dongle and you will be able to toggle it on. So if you look at the bottom of the mouse, you will find the toggle between on and off. Make sure that it's set to on and now you can use the super light on your PlayStation 5. Alternatively, if this doesn't work or you want a wired connection to ensure that you get the best latency possible. All that you have to do is plug the mouse directly into any of the available USB ports. So using the USB-A to USB-C or micro USB cable, plug one end into the super light and another one into the console itself. Once this is done, you will now be able to use the super light on your PlayStation 5. You can open any game and you should see a cursor. You will be able to move your camera, navigate through the menus and so on. If you aren't able to use the mouse inside a specific game, it's usually because that game does not support mouse and keyboard inputs, so keep that in mind. Each game is different, so you have to make sure that the game that you are trying to play has mouse and keyboard support. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Logitech G Pro X Super Lite to PlayStation 5. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching!